SmartCam 2014's support of multiple toolbars allows users to quickly and easily configure their preferred screen layout. A new set of toolbars is included in the SmartCam version 2014 release. The default display configuration now includes an application task set toolbar containing common geometry, editing and toolpath process task icons relocated from the main toolbar. Let's add an advanced milling process task toolbar to our screen layout and position it to the left hand side of the display. Any toolbar can be floated and floated relative to the main graphics screen or independently of it so that it always remains at a fixed position on the screen. Floating toolbars are resizable. New toolbars can be created as empty to add icons to them later or as copies of an existing toolbar for further modification. As with previous SmartCam releases, task icons can be added to or removed from any toolbar and icons can now be inserted between existing icons on a toolbar. Finally, the content of the right-click options on the menu bar has been extended with toolbar display options. Individual toolbars can be turned off or on, and all toolbars can be turned on as a group. The order of toolbars can be set on screen by repositioning them until you have the order you wish them to appear. For example, we can move the Advanced Milling Task Set toolbar so that it is to the left of the Process toolbar. The support for multiple toolbars and the tools to manage and manipulate them enable every SmartCam user to configure the screen content and layout to their own preferred way of working with SmartCam.